good evening assalamu alaikum to everybody hope you are fine and stay home stay safe dear students today i am going to teach you the topic from botany that is flower and its structure i will try to teach you the practical means by practical means i mean i am with flower this is flower with in my hand and i will try to explain each and every point from this flower first of all you look towards the board i will try to define the flower and then it is structure topic is flower and it is structure let me tell you flower flower is a modified reproductive shoot of a plant when we are talking about the flower it is a shoot but it is modified shoot it is modified in what sense because flower is that part of a plant which helps in what which helps in sexual reproduction no other part of the plant excluding the flower helps in the process of sexual reproduction we can get the plant from the root vegetative in vegetative propagation from the stem from the leaf but that is a sexual reproduction that is not sexual so for sexual reproduction is considered flower is necessary so it is what it is a modified reproductive shoot then if you will talk about the structure of a flower structure point of view you can see flower is composed of or flower contains the four main parts there are four main parts of a flower one two three four these four parts are also called the whorls of a flower so either you say that four main parts of a flower or you can also say that there are four whorls of a flower isn't it the first part of a flower that is calyx second part is corolla third is androecium and fourth one is gynoecium so four parts are there calyx corolla androecium and gynoecium i will show you one by one this is flower this green pot green pot which is i think it is seen to you this green pot of a flower this one is called the calyx this colored pot it is called the second whorl it is called the corolla and then this one this is known as androecium and inner to this that is gynoecium now the question is what is calyx calyx is collection or group of sepals so sepal is what sepal is the unit of calyx sepal is the unit of calyx similarly corolla is group of petals and androecium is simply group of stamens gynoecium is group of corpels so if you will talk about again uh, this uh, calyx it is a group of sepals and corolla group of petals androecium group of stamens gynoecium group of corpels in next video i will discuss these parts one by one in this way like corolla in first next video i will discuss the corolla then next uh, the first one calyx then next corolla and so on now remember if this flower possess all these four parts that is calyx corolla androecium and gynoecium then it is called a complete flower it is called a complete flower 
if it possess if it is missing any of the four organ it is missing any one among the four then it is known as incomplete flower it is known as what incomplete flower in what sense if it is missing that it be i will remove petal here first it was complete because all the four parts were present now it is incomplete because one part is missing here petal is missing here now after that there is a flower which is called a neuter flower neuter flower means the flower which possess the central male and female reproductive organs central central means non functional like example is a ray flowered of what sunflower sunflower possess two types of flowers disc flower floret and a ray floret disc floret is present in center if it is sunflower that has got capitulum or head in florescence this is simply disc floret floret and this is outer one is ray floret the ray florets are simply neuter flowers neuter means male and female reproductive organs are central they are non functional and one more point you need to remember here that is if a flower possess both the sexual organs that is stamen and corpus that flower is called the bisexual flower and if the flower is lacking any of bisexual example potato tomato pea these are bisexual flowers if a flower is lacking any of the sexual organ like it possess only male or female then the flower is called the unisexual flower flower is called what unisexual flower so finally we came to know that flower possess four main parts typical structure otherwise uh, there are flowers uh, which lack like the petal someone if uh, it is uh, simply unisexual that means it will lack like their either male or female because that will possess only one but the four main organs or four main parts that is calyx corolla and rosium and gynosium this calyx and corolla they are also known as accessory parts of a flower calyx and corolla are known as what accessory parts of a flower or they are also known as non essential parts non essential in what sense in simply this sense these parts do not take part directly in reproduction they do not take part directly in reproduction while as androsium and gynosium they are called the essential parts of a flower essential parts of a flower or they are also known as necessary parts of a flower they are also known as necessary parts of a flower if a plant possess unisexual flowers unisexual flowers but unisexual flowers that is male and female are present on the same plant plant is possess unisexual flowers but unisexual flowers are present on the same plant like maize that is called the monoecious that very kind of no plant will be called what monoecious and when the two separate organs are present on two separate plants the kind of is known as dioecious or the plant will be called as dioecious plant lastly remember one point related to this flower that is the smallest flower that is rafflesia which is 0.1 to 1 mm in size rafflesia sorry bolfia the smallest plant is the flower is bolfia bolfia is the smallest flower and rafflesia is the largest flower and this wolfia which is smallest flower of the angiospermus smallest flower of angiospermus that is wolfia it is rootless flower it is rootless plant 
this plant wall here is rootless and it is what aquatic so dear students and other viewers this was all about the typical structure of a flower in next video i will discuss in detail the calyx only i will discuss only what calyx in next video hope you will like my video and if there will be any suggestion you can put that into in my comments take care stay home stay safe bye